Hello, this is Ashi from Crafting with Ashi, and welcome to this video. Thank you for joining me today. I have a sneak peek of all the new wonderful items from the new annual catalogue. And this is the new annual catalogue that goes live now in May 2024 and goes through to April next year. Now I'm filming this in April, so um, custom order hasn't yet happened, but we've been able to order as a demonstrator. And I got some goodies from my pre-order, so I'm going to show you what I got. Now this is the front of the catalogue. Um, I'm not sure when I'm going to make this video live, so I'm not going to show you the inside, but I'm not allowed to show you the inside until the 1st of May. But on the 1st of May, there will be a catalogue launch on my Facebook page. So do check out there for the details. And this is the front of the catalogue. Isn't it lovely? Very retro feel, I know, but it's just lovely. Group of friends um, crafting together, having fun. What could be better than that? So let's stick that aside for now. And let me show you some of the gorgeous stamp sets I got. So my first one is this one's called Loveliest Tree. Now this reminds me of an old favourite of mine, Lovely is a Tree, which was retired quite a number of years ago. It was actually the first time set I ever bought and it's still a firm favourite of mine. It's one of those sets that will never ever leave my stash. So here we've got this lovely tree image. I mean, I actually really like these sentiments as well. Congratulations, thank you, happy birthday and sending heartfelt sympathy. And I love the font, it's really elegant. And then of course you have the matching set of dies, so you can cut out your tree. I think this is going to be lovely for autumn cards, spring cards. I want to do this as well as a silhouette. So I think we're going to have a lot of fun with that. Okay, so let's set that aside over there. Sorry about that, that's the red arrows going overhead. I live in Lincoln and they always train overhead. Okay, so this one is called Attention Shoppers. And I know it maybe just seems a very weird set with a shopping trolley and some bags, but I've got a lot of ideas to use this set where you could fill up this trolley or basket with Christmas presents, birthday presents, um, as you can hear, see here, birthday cakes, plants, all sorts of stuff to actually really jazz it up and make it something special. I think it'd be lovely for Christmas, filled with Christmas presents with a little sentiment that says, you know, here's hoping I've been a good girl, Santa, or something like that. So I'm really excited to have a little play with that i mean even just these little icons here the cake the bottle the bouquet of flowers the little um here the little bag with presents in it i think it all could be really useful also good even in a planner okay then this one is one i've been really excited to see it's called layers of beauty and you've got some lovely sentiments god bless grateful for you happy anniversary you make my heart smile and you've got this lovely sketchy floral here and this actually can be colored in using the matching layering dies and now there's five dye stencils i should say masks and there's five of these and this will color in this whole image really beautifully and this is very similar to enduring beauty which is in the current mini catalog and it's actually carrying over and I've done this in car club with ladies who've never stamped or colour before and they've been able to make absolutely beautiful cards using um, a stamp and masks bundle. It really makes for easy, beautiful colouring and I'm so excited to see another set in the catalogue. And of course it comes with its own set of matching dies to cut everything out and I love here this little sentiment little tag here. So small but so dinky. So we have those. Then I've got another floral one. You know me in florals, I love them. This is called Flowers of Beauty and this is a two-step stamping again. Really, really pretty. And then of course you have the matching dies. Now, these matching dies don't just cut out these images as you can see. You've also got all these extra images like these lovely big florals here and also these gorgeous little borders that you can make. This will cut out these little borders so you have a ton of little flowers but you can also have the um the negative space as well and the positive so really really nice really excited about that some other stamp sets simply said this is a lovely sentiment set let's celebrate thinking of you thanks happy birthday hello just to note really useful sentiments that you lose use for most cards are covered by these sentiments so really happy to see that and you've got two different fonts as well 
And then I've got a couple of background sets. This one's called Drizzling Droplets. And I really like this. This is really pretty just for a background. You could stamp off and just have a very soft background here just to get some interest where you've maybe done a, um, what you call it, a blended background, an ink blended background. I think it would be lovely. And then you've got this one here called Leaf Collection. It's a very bold background stamp. And I think it'll be lovely just with a sentiment to make up a card. Also, I think it'll look great heat embossed or also embossed resist lots of things you can do with that an embossing folder and this is called the eyelet 3d embossing folder and you can see the pattern there sorry about the glare and then we've got some ginormous embossing folders this year and this one's called the dotted circles and it's a 3d embossing folder and how big is this one this measures about 22 and a half centimeters by um, about 16 and a half so in inches that's eight and a half inches by six inches it's a really lovely big embossing folder I mean you can see there against my hand and I've got big hands and then we've got another one this is called so swirly and this is just a normal embossing folder it's not 3d <coughs> so that is all our stamps and embossing folders so let's move that quickly out of the way like that and let's have a look at what else we've got so i'm going to move on to i'm going to show you a kit that i bought and this kit is called the uh, your day to shine kit and i love the boxes they come in and this is a non-stamping kit and you get everything you need in the kit and here you can see the lovely i'm um, sorry about the glare the lovely cards you can make you can see all of these kits on the website i love a kit to take with me when i go away easy crafting on the go definitely a plus okay so let's move on to some embellishments quickly and we have a few here actually let's not move on to embellishments let me change my mind and show you the wonderful new in colors so let's move on we have five new in colors let, and i present to you Petunia Pop, Shy Shamrock, um, Summer Splash. The colours don't look right, I can see immediately on the camera. Pretty in Pink and Peach Pie. So do go onto the website to have a look and see. Because the greens look a bit weird on the camera. So those are the new in colours. We also have a new staple colour called basic beige and i think this is very similar to what we used to have called um sandy sahara was it something like that really nice beige or sort of an ivory color you know you can remember in the old days we had the naturals and we had a naturals ivory or something or naturals cream and it's very similar in color to that okay so let me show you the ink pad Sorry, my voice was going away. We have the basic beige. And we've got again peach pie. Summer splash. Shy shamrock. Pretty in pink and petunia pop. And this is my refill of my balmy blue. So I'll show you those colours here. And you can see them. Those are the new in colours. Aren't they fabulous? And then I've got the new ribbons to go with them. And these are called the bordered ribbon in all those wonderful colours. Okay. And then we've got the blends, as you can see here. And then I've got the stamp and write markers as well. And then some other embellishments quickly. We have here, these are called the 24 to 26 in color resin dots and then we have here the adhesive backed pearl trio we have here the basic gray and smoky slate pearls and we have here i love these they're cute the 24 to 26 in color shimmer gems and they just look so shimmery and pretty then we also have this ribbon duo 
and this is petal pink white diagonal trim and there's two of them you can see here the petal pink and the basic white very nice and then we have these and I've been looking forward to getting these these are some trinkets I do like some dimension on my cards and then industrial trinkets look at them really nice really nice and chunky you could even make these into earrings they'd look really cute as well really nice and chunky industrial gems okay let's see what else we've got some paper and stuff to show you so I'm going to stop this video now and I'm going to do a part two with my paper, all my paper, and my memory and more cards, etc. So stick around for that. Thank you.